Budget cuts have impacted the Kern County Library System all summer. 17's Karen Waugh is joining us now from our newsroom to show you how those cuts are not putting a damper on special events at our libraries. Karen? Jim, so you've heard of Comic-Con, but now there's Mini-Con. It's the library system's way of gathering superhero and comic book fans alike. And it was completely free, proving they could still have fun without the funds. Not all heroes wear capes, and those include the workers at the library. Today, Beale Library brought Comic-Con to downtown Bakersfield, pulling out all the stops with trivia, a costume contest, local artists, and vendors. But it wasn't just kids that showed up. First of all, it was just me and my love for the movie and my love for cosplay and, and, and cons, and she just kind of followed suit. Despite operating on a paperback budget, the Kern County Library System has had no shortage of free events this summer, including a Touch the Truck event last month that brought out hundreds. Everyone here is donating their time. Yeah, the library struggles financially, but we have a community that clearly values us because they continue to show up and just donate their time and work hard for us, and we work really hard with what we've got. Earlier this summer, hundreds of volunteers petitioned for the library tax measure, which would double Kern County's library funding. It did not make the ballot. Uh, the library can be everything that the community puts into it. So if you show up, that's numbers that shows that we're still important because we are. Dyer said the library is able to keep putting on free events because of volunteers and donations. It's sad that they're cutting the, the budgets for, for libraries, but that they still do something like this, the hard work they put in for the event, I think it's great. The Kern County Library System has more novel ideas for events this fall. They'll have Heart Park After Dark and several Halloween events. Kirin Hua. 17 News. Thanks, Karen.